So throughout my life, the way that I describe other people is reflected back to me in the exact way that they describe and think about me. Every time that I've thought someone was cold or distant or aloof, I have been shocked when they tell me that they find me cold, distant, and aloof, like to the T using the exact same descriptive words. And it works the other way around, too. Anytime I found someone warm and loving and welcoming and approachable, they have told me that they find me those exact same things. So what does this say about how we attract things and people into our reality? Well, here's the thing. The way you expect someone to show up is the exact way that they are going to show up. So if you expect someone to be rude, then you better believe they are going to be rude. If you go into a situation expecting someone to be friendly and loving and welcoming, then that's how they're going to be. Everyone that you meet is a reflection of you. And, you know, all these spiritual teachers say that, and it's kind of hard to really grasp. But we are all parts of the same, and we live in a holographic universe where each one of us uh, is a little piece of the whole. If you know how a hologram works, you can cut it up into as many different pieces of as many different sizes, and each one still reflects the entire image. So when we say that people are reflections of you, they literally are. You are projecting out into the world how you expect people to treat you, how you expect people to view you, how you expect people to react towards you. And a lot of that is a direct reflection of the way that you feel about yourself. My name is Chris Ashley. Follow me for more. I have a book coming out soon called Change Your Mind to Change Your Reality, where I talk about all these things and so much more. And if you head over to my website, changeyourmindtochangeyourreality.com, sign up for my newsletter. I will send you a free guide that is going to help you manifest your dream life. I'll see you soon.